Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Man the Maker. Welcome back. This is Age of Wonders Planetfall. We are the Celestial Assembly. And we did just lose a unit. I hate losing units. We lost a unit. Son of a bee. You're out of movement. So you guys... I do want to upgrade you. But I don't have the money right now. So no, we're not going to do that. Um, what I am going to do... We have the influence, I think, to go and pick up a tier 3 unit from Autonom. Hey guys. Give me a Justicar. The monitor does what? Transmit repair nanites. I can't look at it here. I have to, okay. I could have done it from that screen as well, probably. Um, monitor? Just got your defense laser. Range of seven. Eh. Initialize connections. Network all friendly mechanical units. Granting them a bonus that becomes stronger with each subsequent use. We don't have that many any mechanical units really. It can be incredibly powerful, but alas, not for us. And we can repair things. Wow. Transmit the monitor would be very, very, very good if you have a lot of mechanical units, but we're all cyborg, baby, so not super great for us. Instead, we are going to pick up a just a car. Just a car, just a car, just a car. Here we go. Let's have a good let's have a chat with you guys. I mean the factory overseers probably would be also uh, a nice thing to do, but we're gonna We're gonna go ahead and buy that, giving us yeah, 40 favor required for the next state. Okay. You are going to come and join this army as quickly as you possibly can, which is going to be fairly slow. We've also got covert Everyone infiltration. Everyone needs an excuse to do what they wanted all along. They have stuff that we want. Who decided they get to keep it just because they got there first? Zerera Tan of House Wayan, diplomatic consort. I couldn't agree more. Oh, I spent all of my... <laughs> oh, okay, we have to wait three turns then uh, before we can go ahead and use Energy Siphon. That's too bad. That would be quite nice. Quite nice to get. Um, anyways, alright, confirm movement. You're going over to the Heavy Weapons Factory. And what are we doing with you? You're, I mean, I think you're just gonna kind of be out here exploring, right? Let me come down here and clear some things. The Tundra is so slow though. You can move so much faster if you're just up here. So we're gonna do that. You, my friend. Is this not? Oh, here. This is spacers, just marauders. Oh, it's water. And this is the Uruk. Where in the hell are our opponents? Where's the growth place? I'm just, I'm so perplexed by this. How can it be that we have only encountered one of the six people when we have this much of the map explored? I really don't get it. Um, you... I'll take a look again. This is the Autonom faction. Not going to worry about that. I think we're just going to save our energy. Just keep, you can just keep wandering around over here. That's probably fine. And we are going to end our turn. I mean, technically we do have a replacement here, but I think you're going to be a little bit better. We don't have any mods that we can give to you, no. Just end the turn. Opponents are moving. What about Robin? Still are at war with spaces. We're actually at war with just everyone over here, apparently. <laughs> and somehow there's a thing to pick up over here, which I didn't see. Energy stash. Sure would love that now. Slowly make our way over here. This is just the—it's the worst terrain. 
Which is kind of good. Oh. Somebody has Warmonger. Two people? Enter war with another player and kill six units belonging to another player. So they are fighting out there. And they got a tier three tier two unit for that. Well, good for you guys. Good for you. Um, he dropped in this abandoned Ooh. colony. Well, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, upgrading the colony militia. I mean, frankly, right now, we don't need you. We do need you to make us one more unit. Is it going to be the Lightbringer? I can get down with that. Let's make one. Only after we upgrade our buildings. Because, right, this guy is still operating with less than a full stack, which is not great. He also even has still one of these, um, these inspectors, which are pretty lackluster. Uh, you... Oh, get the fly, so you're actually going to catch back up with them quite quickly. Armies are merged. You can go get this. And then this. What, what does that do? Experience? No, it's just a repair station. Yeah, you're going to also slowly work your way out there. We do have a tier 3 unit now, which is nice. So, so, so slowly move your way over into this area. Maybe I should go up through here? Huh. Probably a smarter choice, considering how slow this stuff goes. I mean, we can get this, right? We will have you come over here and pick this up. But this base movement cost is ridiculous. Just ridiculous. And you... I mean, we we can we have sensor views over here, so we know what, what the deal is. And I don't think I'm going to actually move in and attack. No, you're going to continue moving out into areas unknown. Is that a stash? Cosmite stash, yeah, please. How can it be that we still haven't encountered our opponents? I really don't get it. And this is also the worst way to go. Making all the wrong decisions here, folks. All the wrong, all the wrong choices. Yeah, you're going to try and cross there. We do have ourselves a colony. Um, which I think... We're going to bring down to here. Mm, or to here. Actually, this one gives us access to that double production, which I do quite like. Yeah, we're just going to go down there to the Tiberius complex. Completely, completely unarmed, completely naked. No, no, no defense. It's going to be fine. I'm pretty sure there's going to be nothing down there that's going to mess with us. Let's just go. Vroom, vroom. And uh, we need more influence, so, yep. Just go ahead and end our turn. <sighs> Still very low on the energy income. We are doing things to try and fix that, right? Namely, this colony. This colony's entire purpose. Oh. Upgrade sector? Well, I'm already doing that, aren't I? Yeah, next turn, you're actually going to have these sectors upgraded. Both of them. What's that sound? Scary things happening? No, we're okay. I do, I'm, you know, I do really wish you could build roads. It doesn't make a lot of sense that I can't actually connect my two colonies here. Handle hero, join offer. You have a sniper rifle. We still can't afford you. The Pulse Sniper. High impact stagger on the sniper, which is nice. But, no. We're going to request another hero. And 
you're just going to continue coming down here and seeing what's up. That's fine. We might even be able to ask these guys to leave. I don't know who is there. Uh, you get the bonus experience. And then come up this way. And then you're going to cross over there. Very good. You're just going to come out here. Oh, I accidentally picked up the Cosmite Stash. Also pick up more research. Thank you very much. And still failing to uh, encounter anybody. Where are five other opponents? One of them is dead. <gasps> Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Holy crap. Somebody died. All right. You are just going to march your way back up here ever so slowly. I know I'm, I've been wait I've wasted so much time with this guy. I feel pretty I feel a little bit bad about that one. Um, you're going to come up this way. Where does the teleport go to? Oh, really? Huh. Oh, that would have been good to know. I could have just ran him down here, teleported. Pirate's hideout spawned down there. Yeah, you're going to come look over here again. Oh, there's a quest army. A strong one, too. Yeah, no thanks. And you uh, have a void storm going on over here, too. What are you guys? Marauder guards. You don't show up as hostile. You're not. You're not wanderers. Star Reacher. Station with that orbital defense on blink. What does that do? Deals a lot of damage. Well, Star Reacher's gate station. Spaceship maintenance bay. Mechanical units in this colony have plus two resistance to all damage. Wow. Um, Forinoid, you finished your production. Great. Good for you. Um, doesn't make a lot of... It's not like... It's not that useful for us, so no. Let's see what else we can get here. Um, the Botanical Gardens is a choice. I mean, the thing is, is our capital gets that plus one. I mean, you actually will get the plus one. So it does make sense for you to also build these things. The Specialist Center and the Skirmisher Barracks. Yeah, do it. Botanical Gardens, improve military infrastructure. Seems good. You should be almost ready to absorb a new sector. Is it at 11 or I think it's 12, which is going to be the planetary core drill over here. That's it for that turn. Would make sense for you to have an electrical sector, energy sector, because of that unit upkeep. Since you've made all of our units, I think we're probably going to do that whenever it is you get your next sector. I'm not entirely sure which ones we're going to pick. It would make the most sense to go out in this direction and be a little bit more safe. Oh, oh no! Oh man, my scout. Impossible. No. Oh, scout's dead. That's too bad. Um, this scout, however, I think you're just... It's time for you to go out into the unknown. And find somebody else! Are you freaking Vanguard again? You're Syndicate. Nice to meet you, Syndicate. Reputation, we are trustworthy. 
positive first contact would just meet minus 10. <sighs> Unknown secret technology. Yeah. What is this 75? Our opinion. Positive first contact just met accepted race relation. Indeed, indeed. Syndicate are accepted towards us. Could do pronouncements with you? We could compliment you. Spend 10 influence and improve the opinion. By a hundred. Yes. Let's do that. And it's forever. Is it forever? Was complimented 15 turns. Okay. Should not say the best relationship. This will pave the way towards mutual respect. Offer a non-aggression pact? We cannot. Three turns. Okay. Okay, good to know. Thank you. Nice to finally meet somebody else. I guess you're over here somewhere. A message from Ajnam Faction. What do you guys want? Emergency service. You want me to destroy a wildlife nest? Um, we do need to do that. Provincial weapon augments. Increase target damage by 20% for two turns. Oh, it's pretty good. We can accept it. And you can come down here and found ourselves an assembly colony. There's a gravity generator. You are going to come and remove this, I suppose. Um, <laughs> okay. Yes, do that, please. And really, really annoyingly, <sighs> I have been such an idiot with this army. Just come down here and clear the damn things out, okay? Just clear them out. You've built the army. And honestly, we've got nothing else for you to construct right now. 25% efficiency is pretty terrible. That 36 knowledge is huge, though. That is a massive, massive, massive bonus. That's why we're getting more energy. I do need the energy. We're going to have to do that. As much as I would like to do other things. Ops are ready to prime. Yeah, I can't do energy siphon yet. That's going to be next turn. You are going to cross out over here. Not going to build the base because I want to steal things from you. You have some orders. Which is going to be just to move up here. There is a stash there. Which this guy can just go and swoop and pick up. Spacers come rushing over to you begging that you allow them to have the stash. They tell you their trucks are damaged and they need the parts to repair the glitch. Um, I will definitely take the 15 relation. Definitely. Um, rather, not relation, uh, thingamathang. Boom, we can now cast energy siphon. Yes, please. Do it. Do it. And you can come over here. Uh, nope, we're not going to do anything with that. Come join up with them. And carry onward. We're going to move our way out of here. Nice! Okay, new army has joined. New unit will be joining. One day, this army will do a thing. <laughs> One day in the far, far future. Two turns until... Yeah, still five turns until it's forced exploitation. Taking forever. But it's, it's going to be very, very, very much worth it because everywhere here, everywhere here, can use it, I think. Pretty much every single one of my sectors has it. What is this? Yes. Got to keep my eye on this. There's a chance that they move out and attack us. But soon we're going to have these two armies here together. And maybe we can, we can move on the stale steps over here. 
I don't know. Okay, look. Two armies there. Very likely that they are... Very, very likely that they are Robin Booker. Yeah. So I gotta be pretty careful here. Unfortunately, there is a road. Which means you can uh, kind of retreat away from that. You, my good friend. Why would you go through... Oh, you need to go through the mountain. What are you? Tier 2? Um, yeah, we're going to take the fight for the Imperial Stash. I mean, of course we are. And it says safe battle, but because you guys are idiots, and time and time again, I have been screwed by this. We are, um, going to do the fight ourselves. Ignore that. This is my last recording session for a couple of days. I've been very fortunate. Fortunate that I've smashed my shin into... Well, it's not broken. But, uh, serious, serious damage has been done to myself. And I'm fortunate because that has given me so much recording time. These things look like they explode. They don't? Okay. Um, you, my friend. You're probably melee. Lancer. And I bet you you have, like, a leaping attack. Laser Lance. Ooh, wow. Centenary damage, laser lance strike. Yep. High impact, incendiary, flanking, and charge. <whistles> okay. You're nothing, you're nothing small, that's for sure. And this is what's giving you, this is what's giving you all the incendiary. You also have five shields. Lots of psionic resistance and you're very happy. You're pretty scary. You are actually pretty scary, actually. Why not, actually? This thing is not. Are you frenzied? You are tier two, are you? Uh, no, tier one. Rending Claws and Battle Vomit, not not worried. You are the same thing. Let's move you up to here. And spit you out right there. Thanks for joining the team. Really annoy myself that I did not resurrect when I could have. Ugh. You are going to uh, definitely overwatch. And you're going to move up. And also overwatch. The Justicar. What is the range on this? Nine? Will you tell me? It is nine. And this is also nine. You can reach all the way out to there. But probably... We'll just move you up to here. And we can sentence you. Sentencing does what exactly? Minus two resistance and 15% easier to hit. Yep, you've been sentenced. You guys... Just come over here. Slightly obscured. Right, if we can get a flanking charge with them somehow, we're gonna go for it. don't know what they're going to do, if they're going to move in enough to make that even possible. Alright, end the turn. Let's see what you got, man. You, you got some serious damage. Overwatch triggered. Nice with the miss. Overwatch triggered. Blah, blah. Static charge. Stacking up that damage. As expected. Ow. Oh, it's only these guys, though. That's fine. And you're going to run in. And get overwatched? Battle vomit. 
Overwatch has been triggered. You've also been marked. Unit lost. Mm -hmm. Yep, okay. You killed my unit there, which is fine. Um, you will not die from the bleeding. Five damage. You have kinetic weakness. You might die from the bleeding. You are definitely going to go in here and smack this guy in the face. Are you? I think... Let's see, what's what's your percentage chance to hit here? 61%. We could just blow all this thing to crap. It seems like a good choice to me, rather than marking you. Right, removing your cover. Enemy Boom. Annihilated. Yeah. Which means you're going to have 93% chance to kill. And you're going to crit... I love these freaking Vorpal Snipers. Enemy annihilated. Um, you guys just charge in. Come on over here. Tall growth, you're slightly obscured. You're just gonna shotgun this guy in the face. Blah, blah. You can shoot at him, 55% chance, but very likely just take you out one miss Enemy and the kill aid. yeah the static charge the assembly march on if we had more units we don't have the electrocutioner we don't have a single electrocutioner hmm so it's not as good because i mean we can't stack that damage you build up your expert now soon you're gonna have a lot more morale which is ter not good for you we don't we don't attack very often with you. So I don't really see how that kind of meshes with the rest of your character. But it is what it is. Why don't I take the food? Terraforming outpost. Okay. Um, done. Electron impact has been researched. Arc weapons allow us to disrupt the electrical signals naturally occurring in neural and mechanical control systems. What you see as drooling paralysis is really just the body running without any direct communication with the mind. Claudius Proton, assembly researcher. Yeah, this unit mod, if we come upon somebody who favors uh, melee attacks, I can see this becoming more useful on our melee units, but since we're against the Vanguard, and it seems like I think they're mostly shooty shooty bang bang, we're not going to worry about it, but we did get this operation, Arc Manifold, which I think is going to be very, very useful. Quite strong. Star Presence is slow. They are really good, though. Um, hmm. The Submarine. No need for it. Transport Reinforcement. No, I don't think so. Cloaking Implants. The supercharge, again, this could be really useful, but I'm not sure. Deploying Constrictor, probably pretty strong as well. The chance of healing and negate, meh. I mean, negate, if you've got like your high level unit and you ran them in and they just did a bunch of stuff, you can just run them in and be like, oh, you're about to die. You're completely safe now. How much does it cost? 45 and four cast points. That's a lot of cast points. I think we'll go with adaptive systems here. We did get another hero join offer. You do have a weapon. Consuming gaze. This unit channels dark psionic energy through its eyes, dealing damage and healing the caster. You also have an arc sword. High impact stagger units. It is arc damage as well. Repeating. Consuming gaze seems pretty good. What is this? Is this where you get consuming gaze from? Indeed it is. Indeed it is. I'm just gonna cancel and you can stay there for now. Commander has upgraded. Beautiful. Deny the wicked. 
Every unit in the hero's armies has two damage reduction in all channels against attacks from units with soul burn. We don't have a lot of ways to, to soul burn anybody. Stunning Discharge. Here's building Discharge Mana when activated. It deals damage to all adjacent friendly and enemy units with a chance to stun. Deny the Wicked, I think, will be very, very powerful at some point. You already have Infantry Commander, you do. All around awareness. Can no longer be flanked, yeah. I think I want Cybernetic Overdrive. Just giving the sniper first, uh, maybe a, a first shot. It's a range of seven as well. Really, it's. I would only kind of use it with the sniper and with this. Sentencing two targets right off the bat. Yeah. Not bad. I mean, denying the wicked will definitely become very, very powerful after a certain point. You know what? We have to go for it. We just have to. We have to. Stabilizers, I don't care. And we're not going to go for close quarter specialists. We're also going to ignore assimilate. Not going to happen. We'll hold on to our points here. Also, there's no, no weapons that I would think about also equipping here, right? Lightning Blade, the Feldfire, no. It is tier 3. Secondary weapon. Improved Imperial Revolver. It is 16 damage. The problem with this is it's such low range. I almost never really get to use it. That single shot, 21 damage. Could be pretty useful. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to stick with... Oh, cancel. I'm just going to stick with it. I'm not going to do that. Go ahead and just end that. We can confirm our movement. Ooh. Operation Ready Energy Siphon. Robin Booker. Success chance is too low? How? Why? Where does it tell me the, the chance? I can't do it to anyone. Operations primed and ready. Um, okay, looks like we're just gonna hold on to that. <laughs> that's that's really too bad. I don't know why. Why why is it so low? Hmm. That is a shame. That is a shame. You are going to come and meet up with you. We're going to use you. That's the heavy weapons factory. How do we remove... That's a wildlife nest. That's the gravity generator. Please uh, evacuate the location. Oh! That's really good rewards for that. And is there no more heavy gravity here? No, there is not. Great! Well done, sir. Well done, sirs and ladies. You're going to stay there. Orders are required by you. We're not quite ready to fight this guy. Um... Two to all resistances. Maybe we do go. I mean, who, who's given us this quest? Paragon Heavy Soldier. Yeah, super, super scary. Fanatics. All these fanatics. Tier 2 with overdrive. Ugh. And all these guys that can be overdrived. Ugh. And frickin' Voidstorm. Ugh. Not ideal. Is this our opponent? There's the Verdant people. This is the other one? 
Hydron, you've built all the things that uh, you were supposed to. We're getting enough energy right now. I'm gonna go for the research. It's a really, it's a, it's a absurd, just an, an insane boost, actually. Ops ready to launch, yeah, but unfortunately we can't do it. Too low, too low, huh? How do we get it higher? I'm not sure. But that's it for this episode. Next turn, I mean, we're gonna move. We're gonna move on stale steps and see what happens. Not a clue. Do not know if, I mean, if she's got no actual forces there, then we can probably try and take it out. If she does, it might be a little bit too hard. Has she upgraded her militia? I'm, I'm not sure. Um, for, no, no, you do this, the military skirmishers, great. But you've got plenty of things queued up. So, fine. Fine, fine, fine. The Lightning Riders, yes. Why do you... What is the six... What are these numbers here? I don't really get it. I don't really get it. But, like I said, that's the end of this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, my name is Man the Maker. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful day.